Hello everyone, welcome to the second SpaceX update video of the day. Today, SpaceX completed another doubleheader by launching the Starlink Group 622 mission from SLC-40 at Cape Canaveral. Four, this mission had three, a brief delay to two, allow the teams to focus one, on NASA's Psyche mission. Engine full power and lift off of Starlink. Go Starlink, go Falcon. If you missed the Psyche mission launch, you can catch it in my previous video. A Falcon 9 rocket successfully delivered another batch of 22 Starlink satellites into low Fair Earth orbit. Confirmed. The first stage booster, stage designated B-1067, launched and landed for the impressive 14th time. This mission also marked SpaceX's 73rd mission of the year. Stage 1 landing confirmed. Moving over to Texas, in less than 24 hours after SpaceX transported Starship S-29 to the Rocket Garden from Massey's, SpaceX conducted a cryogenic proofing test on Super Heavy Booster 11. Having the Massey's test site at their disposal gives SpaceX a significant advantage for testing their boosters and Starships, eliminating the need for the orbital launch mount, as in the early days. For all you Starship test fire fans, a new MSIB has been issued for potential Starship testing on the 17th. This lines up perfectly with the road closure schedule posted on the Cameron County website. We are eagerly anticipating the long-awaited static fire test of a flapless Starship prototype without TPS tiles, Starship S26. I'll provide more information about this test in my next video. That concludes this short update video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.